This time between Croatia's Ivan Fesic. Won two Karate One Premier League gold medals. He came through the rounds 2 0, 3 0, 3 2, 2 2, and a 2 0. 21 years old. His opposition here from the Ukraine, Valeri Chobotar, 24 years old. He came through the rounds with a 5 1, an 8 0 win, 4 2, and he lost 7 2 against Fadikar of Iran, who will be going for gold shortly. Referee for this match isn't as you see on from Aspari. This is Pirkonen, Pirko Heinonen from Finland. He's just trying to test the cover target with those double Jonema Washis. Puts in the kick again, and a good show of sportsmanship from both players. A little bit more pressure coming from Fesic in red, the Croatian. Big guys, strong karateka. Chobata receives a chokoku for holding on with two hands. Not allowed to do that. Can hold with two hands if there is a kick delivered. Yes. But that's the only time that you can do that. Zuki attempt from Kvesic. Kvesic just testing, tapping the front hand of Chobata. See if he can push it out of the way. As he makes his attack, is Chobata who attempts the counter punch. Both really quite tall, over two meters, these players. Zamazuki attempt there from Kovacic, and it's a video challenge from his coach, who believes it was good enough to score. Down to the referee review panel. The video review panel makes a decision based on those six criteria. Can't quite see there from the angle. And again, it's been rejected. There's only been one challenge accepted, I think, so far today, hasn't it, David? Yes, yes, very, very few. But this is only because the amount was before the points. Just a, a while, a, not a second. Yeah, exactly. Nothing, and, nothing. It, and, and, it, and and if it is the case of Yame, then yes. he can't score. But there was no problem with this one, though. Chobotor has opened the score. He's received a Yuko. Yes. He now has the Sentu advantage also. We're coming into the last minute of the match. There's a couple of wild swings from the Croatian Ivan Kvesic. Close. Close. Uh, but a Chobata steps back off the tatami. No problem here because he has 43 seconds, but if he did that in the last 15 seconds, he would lose the century advantage. This is the referee just uh, calling the doctor over. I think there might be a... There is a cut. Yes.
Because I can't see from obviously from this angle whether it's the nose or the or but the lip. We didn't see enough. Clean, I don't think there clean. was anything that no. seemed untoward to cause that. No. But we didn't see enough good uh, clean technique in this fight. Eh? Not really. No. 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 He still has that one Yuko point lead. Yes. With many action, many attacks, but not enough clean. Not no. Not good technique. So whilst we're just waiting for the players to come back on to the tatami and, and start the match, David, perhaps you can just talk about the Youth Olympics we've got coming up later this year. That's going yes. to be fantastic. <laughs> and you'll be there, of course. Yes, for sure. <laughs> yes, it's, it's, it's our first Olympic Youth Games that uh, is going to, to be in, uh, next October in Buenos Aires. We are processing with yeah. our uh, selection and uh, yeah. the standing. <laughs> The Olympic standing for Buenos Aires is running. Everybody can find candid points. So, four flags. Everybody can find uh, the Olympic uh, youth standing in uh, our website, wkf.net, uh, uh, and uh, all the information necessary to understand what is going on. And uh, but the best event will be in uh, Yumag in the end of uh, June where uh, all the national federation will have the opportunity to qualify directly uh, one athlete for olympic category as we know we have three male and three female olympic categories in junior categories and uh, every national federation that uh, uh, not qualify uh, an athlete in the same category can register one athlete and uh, is a double event one uh, event on friday 28 june and the one uh, event in, on Saturday, 29 June. And uh, every national federation can register one athlete one day. And uh, if uh, uh, they didn't get uh, the first or the second uh, place, they can register the same athletes for next day. So the first two places, the first day, and the first two places the next day in the same category can go directly to the Youth Olympic Games in Buenos Aires. And this is a, a great opportunity for many national federations. Well, that's going to be absolutely incredible uh, for the youngsters. It'll be the first time that karate will feature in the Olympics. The big one will come later in 2020, of course, and we can talk about that a little later yes. on. Well, we come to the end of that match, and it was Valerie Chobotar who succeeded in taking the bronze medal with that 2-0 win over... Croatia's Ivan Kvesic and the knock that he did receive to his face didn't have uh, any impact really other than to uh, allow him a little bit of time to recover and get back into the match to go on and take